Hi guys, so um, this is um, video number 5 okay, of um, how to properly pray and my, um, my experiences and obstacles in um, reading the Bible, okay? Um, so, having said that, right? Um, so, having said that, uh, I mentioned that with praying, right? Jesus came down here. Um, to show us how to live life, how to have a proper connection with God, save us, save us from, imagine if he didn't save us, every time you sin, guys, and don't tell me you're not sinning, right now you're probably sinning, like at the moment, like you probably have, I don't know, 20 sin since you got up this morning, right? So you're going to be stoned to death just because out of your sin, just like that, you know, that woman who was caught doing adultery human being are are naturally have born with sinful ways why that's what the representation of adam and eve we have that nature in us so the devil knows that he knows our weakness so he's gonna target those weakness to um uh, to use it against us and you know um whatever that that is but sex is god made sex to uh, for procreation first and for a pleasure between man and, and and wife because it's hard to raise children right but it's been you know different you know i'm not gonna even mention now it's going bad again we don't want what happened i'm just gonna mention the sodom and gomorrah because i did a video please watch we don't want that to happen again especially not COVID is happening as a christian you, you can't you can't really um not think that it could be but i'm not god right don't play God. You don't know. Like everybody's giving speculations of we don't know what's happening. Only God. So what do you do? Just connect more to God, right? And I love that everybody, like even when you see twenty year old saying, Oh, I found Jesus and it just gives me joy reading all those comments now that oh I found Jesus through you. That's what encouraged me. I found Jesus through this channel. Not through mine, because I'm just starting new, but through these um People that I I follow, the preacher that I follow, because based on this um, the scripture of um, of Jesus, I follow um, Bill Graham and Stanley Charles Stanley. Um, I love I love um, their um, you know um, he's Baptist and I believe born again. And um, in the Philippines, uh, we have it's just because he's a movie star, he's popular, and he's really a dig a very dignified man husband material because he's a christian and he follows god and he's not um he's gone through a lot of you know and he he won't he's committed to god and he's committed to his family right um i you know i follow him as well um but not much that i uh, follow i just want you to um to know if you wanted to follow but i also check because i used to follow other um uh, preacher preacher and then I am finding that they're not really supposed to. Women cannot teach unless um, you, you can be a pastor, a woman pastor, but you cannot teach unless you're a pastor. I'm just a middle person trying to, you can spread the word because we're supposed to bring the light, right? Uh, that's our job. That's what Jesus did. He came down from. So everybody who's not Christian, we're supposed to bring the light to God, right? So. I remember when I'm with my friends and people say this, you know, it's hard to date uh, people, someone who doesn't believe in God, right? Because I have friends that just only when they have a little alcohol, so I forgive them because they're not in their proper sense, right? But they'll also say, Melody, please stop your God, talk about God. Please stop it, not right now, right? But like I said, forgive them, they're under all the alcohol, uh, right? And they've been my friend too, regardless of who they are, if they're not Christian. Um, I don't have, I don't do dinner tables with them. I don't, um, they're not directly in my home. So I see them on the purpose of just a friendship, to get away from life for a meantime, right? Meantime, a Philippine accent. So it's just, it's important that um, we know that, okay, I'm not going to stop talking about God, right? You know, because I'm not going to stop talking about Jesus. You know what? It's just me he lives in me he lives in me through the holy spirit and that's what um 